All right, this is just a short one. So I have a couple boxes I want to open up. The only thing I like about this event is this. All these Jubilee boxes. I got like 36 of them. And that's just on one character. And I like the motifs. Not only, I knew a lot of them. I still need a lot. Some, they must even took out a game because I ain't found one in years. Um, it's more or less this. Trans. No charge. I need them crystals. Sale. I don't PvP. And I don't dungeon dodge, so this is the only way I get that stuff. It's kind of, kind of pain in the ass that you have to do PvP or something to get them. Because I suck at it. I mean, but to do anything gear, you, you definitely want to take your time, make a character correctly, master your crap, to, so to speak. Like a um, forever. I'm just not into that. I find it actually kind of boring. I mean, I could go up there for an hour. Well, I did in the beginning years ago. Go up there for a few hours. I just didn't like that. I just win a keep, lose a keep. Get a hole, lose a hole. Yeah, you know, back and forth. And different times. You could, uh have it for like a couple hours but then there's night falls different people from different areas come in there and change the tide and I was always more or less running around solo or uh, a couple times I got into what the hell are they called uh, little shit pot groups so See, that's definitely what I want, right there. You see, I have a lot of motifs already. Very mild of the recipes. Those, what I'm also after the Perfect row. It saves me a lot of fishing. <laughs> I don't mind fishing though. I just wish they would add more shit into the water that you can catch. I mean, you can get a few recipes, but I like to see more in there. I like to see a fishing event that you can get. These here I've been getting quite off. I've been getting these quite often. They ain't fucking selling, so. <laughs> this actually, whatever I don't know and doesn't sell, is more or less like, it'll sell eventually throughout the year. So that's my yearly income the after the event. You used to have with two computers, I was in like I nine. erect the spine of welcome. I hate that. Welcome to they the bank of They should only say one time. If you go back and forth, you should shut up. But I've been in like nine guilds on two computers. Um, it's kind of pain in the ass. And especially I wasn't selling shit in either one of them. I think I was paying out 40, 50,000 a week. But only bringing in like 5,000. I had a couple nice people before I got uh, the trade thing here to tell you 
roughly about what things sell for. I was just throwing them in there for you know, a couple bucks. Then somebody would buy them, send them back to me. Say, hey, that's worth a lot more than that. So I'm just lucky to make a sell, man. But you know, this stuff here. I wish he would make it like some of the other games. Like Black Desert, they're changing a lot of their stuff, so if if you're on one character, all your characters know everything and are the same grinding skill and shit like that. So you can move use more characters than just one alt. I mean twenty characters they're just basically storage to me. I got a few that I use, like her. <laughs> I actually had somebody try to pick up on her the other day. Asking me about shy and all that. <laughs> no, I'm a fucking guy, dude. Man, bugger off. But. See, well, why do you make summons your champion? Do you Why do you make cool. a female character? I I haven't made a female character before I started playing Black Desert. Black Desert their um their classes nice are, hole. Uh, gender locked. Certain ones like um, a bow build, you have a Archer and a ranger. Archer's male, ranger's female. And a couple of things are changed in their skill line. They both use the bow and stuff like that. But if you just pick one, like uh, the ranger is a female. If you pick that, you can't change it to male. So unless you pick the archer. And <coughs> I mostly use a. What the hell is it? Dark Knight. That's a female. Um, I like the class. It's pretty quick. It's almost like the Templar. Because with the swords and that, it jabs. I mean, super quick. I often miss because he'll go from here to that rock in like a second. And just start spamming. But I often miss my target. Plus, I spam my health potions too much. So I, I don't even try PvP in that. No way. My other computer, for some reason, they want to attack her all the time. I, mean, I hate it. Cause it's like here outside the city, you can make a little um, garden, and you can only make it in a combat zone, which is kind of fucking stupid. So you make a little garden, then you go over and harvest it, and when you harvest it, you're more or less like this, when you go to plant it. So you're in here, and you gotta try to get out when you're being attacked. Now, if you have farming gear on, or some kind of thing like News that, the gorge has arrived. you only have, the have been defeated. like a DT of anywhere from 10 to 30, but somebody with damage, it's like you know, 300, just mow your ass right over. You, know? and you can't get out of there fast enough. Your screen turns red, but you're dead. It kind of sucks. Griefing. I hate that shit. Well, talk long enough. Open my things up. Uh, I don't really. I want to get the transmute crystals mostly because I want to make that one, uh, what they call it, Daily Strike set, just to see if it can actually beef up my, um, my channel attacks. It's supposed to, but I just, I don't PTS. I'm getting another hard drive. I might try to put stuff on to it. Well, an external drive. I'm trying to put stuff <coughs> onto it, maybe. 
I'll try to PTS because whenever they would send an update for it, it'd take like 45 minutes to an hour to download, uh, patch, all that shit. And yeah, that's game time. I ain't got time for that shit. Then when I get in there, it's like, what do I want to do? What do I want to check out? Then it becomes actually boring because nothing's worth anything there. I mean, but if it was like an actual extension to the game where you could go and stay there all the time, but it only works during like the new new content coming out they'll open it up but if it worked all year I think I would have played it because you got like start off with just about infinite amount of stuff well I can't say <coughs> infinite because it does have a limit but shit no hardly anybody there you got access to every piece of equipment providing you have the DLC and stuff like that but I would just have fun like that because going grind over shit's pain in the ass so until next one